What's up guys, today I'm going to tell you some stories from when I was in elementary school, and this is also my first bit on this channel, so I hope you enjoy, I'll probably send this out on Instagram. So, the first and only story we're going to talk about is on, uh, when I was back in elementary school in first grade. So, back in first grade, I, uh, I fucking had a class in first grade, but first let me introduce you to the characters of the story. So, the teachers, we're going to name the story, are just going to be teachers. I'll probably shorten it to teach. The main antagonist is going to be called Little Bitch, and the principal is going to be called Miss P, because why not? So, basically, I'm also going to be in the story, obviously. Back in elementary school, at my school at least, we didn't have separate classes. And, uh, excuse the dog. But, since we didn't have separate classes, we were all grouped together in one class. This was a few years ago. But, like, uh, so one day on the intercoms, the intercoms come on and go, Sir, there is going to be a lockdown drill. Note, this is just a drill, so just hide in the corners, close the blinds, and we're going to knock on your doors and scare the shit out of you. And, uh, I'm just like, okay. It's going to be happening. It, it happened like 15 minutes later. But we closed the blinds, locked the doors for those 15 minutes. And then, uh, basically. I can't remember. What the fuck happened in the rest of the story? I'm sorry, this is so unprofessional. <laughs> but, like, uh, so they come by our door and go, it's, and some kids started, and like one kid started fucking crying, I think. She went, and I'm like, why? It's legitimately just a lockdown. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> and so eventually they passed, we lifted up the blinds. But while the blinds were closed, and like the lockdown was happening, little bitch decided he is gonna fucking tickle me. Like, and this is the first grade, so I laugh because th that's the reaction that you give. That's the reaction that you give. And despite everyone screaming, they said everyone did a good job, but my teacher was pissed and was like, "You, I know your ass ain't tough." So screaming during a lockdown drill, ignore the rest of the noise that it's just my pug. But like, I know your ass ain't talking during the lockdown drill. So, you know, I'm just like, you fucking took with me. So they said, I'm going to send you to this other teacher. And so the teach did. And well, dog, I love you. Yes. Fine, I'll give you, I'll give you a pet. But like, um. To this other teacher, and this other teacher comes along and says, So, I got reports that you were laughing during lockdown drills, so I sell out little bitch. I say, Hey, teach little bitch, uh, he fucking tickled me during class. Fuck you for thinking I was laughing just for the shit of it. And, like, I really don't fucking understand that so the teacher brings in little bitch the little bitch comes in gives his side of the story which is completely false by the way he says you hey, fucking tickled me hit me and then started laughing and i'm just and i was in the room at the same time and i'm like bro i never did that to you and then he gave me that look of i know i just lied but fuck you because 
what I did doesn't matter because I did it, but I pinned it on you, so that's your fault. And I'm just like, why? Why? Why you do this to me? So they both send us down to the principal like 15 minutes later. And uh, Miss P, who's our principal, P doesn't stand for principal, by the way. And P is not her name either. And don't think of her name because P is nowhere close to her name. She doesn't have a name. Like Her name isn't like Penelope or some shit like that. But like a uh, fucking... Note this was first grade. So I had no idea how to deal with the principal. I went to a school before this whose principal was an absolute crack job. And this one was no different in my opinion. You can fucking disagree. But fuck you guys. Anyways, continuing on, we got a little sidetracked. My dog is constantly asking for attention, Jesus. But, like, so they send me down to the principal's office with a little bitch. And she, the principal says to me, Eli, you're possibly going to be suspended for three days. Note, I had only been going to this school for three weeks at this point. Three weeks. Three fucking weeks, and I was about to get suspended for three days. And then she said to this other kid, yeah, you're probably going to get to spend three days, too. And then my mom comes in and starts raising hell, and she's like, this kid's not a psychopath. Like, I do innocent until, I do guilty until proven innocent. I always think my son did something, because I'm not that type of person to think, oh, my little Johnny couldn't do nothing. <laughs> but... Come on, man. He's in first grade. He laughed during a file drill. There are kids who are fucking screaming. And you think that's acceptable? Bruh. And the thing is, we had a lot of lockdown drills. Because this school is really close to a bank. And everyone liked to fucking rob that bank. Like, why would you put a school right next to a bank? If you know people, rob it. But, like, um... So... After my mom comes in and starts raising hell, they're like, okay, we're gonna think over our judgment, reanalyze the data, and see whose story matches who. And with the teacher. Now, my teacher fucking hated me. But at this point, she said, yeah, little bitch tickled Eli. And then she's like, well, why did you send him down to the office? Like, what the fuck? They were so confused with her judgment. And I wouldn't be either. Because, like, I would, I was too. Because I'm like, you tickled me. You clearly saw it. Like, bruh. Anyways, little bitch ended up getting suspended for three days. And... So, well, since little bitch got suspended for three days, because it was technically my fault, which it wasn't, it really wasn't, it was his doing, but, you know, he thought it was my fault, it wasn't, so he never talked to me again, and well, the rest is history, I guess. Thank you guys so much for watching this video, hopefully all the way through. I'll probably upload sometime within the next month, but my videos will probably be... Well, I'll probably upload sometime within the next month, but my videos are probably going to be random until I figure out, like, a stable solution, like, when I should upload and when I shouldn't. Hope you can just enjoy it, and that was my elementary school story. Also, I just want you guys to remember, this is my first video on this new channel. I did have a channel before that, but thankfully it's deleted. Peace!